Welcome to the city, where Pac-Man are ruling whilst hopping. Cute Mama Pac and Baby Pac. T-Rex guy stomps the Baby Pac-Man and leaves. The Mama Pac is triggered. One pleasant day at the Super Dinosaur World. The little dinosaurs are hanging out with Mommy T-Rex and her kid. They sat by the tree shade. An evil T-Rex is passing through that area. He comes across the little dinosaurs. What? He desired to eat their heads and fill his stomach. Oh, yeah! The mommy T-Rex is resting therefore he thinks it's the right time to trap them. Little T-Rex sees him holding a bone and goes to him to grab it. As soon as he got near, the evil T-Rex bit his head off and packed it into a bag. The dinosaurs were still resting. Soon T-Rex shows up as a clown to grab the other kid's attention. He throws a few silly tantrums and the little dinos were quite amazed by this. As soon as they came to him, he attacked. He ripped their heads and packed it into a bag. T-Rex got up from sleep what? right before he could run off. There begins the chase. Oh no! T-Rex displaced through a short route and successfully slapped the evil guy with wood. T-Rex then grabs the little dino heads and goes back home. While the evil guy works for an eternity to get rid of the rock. The mommy Trex then mismatched T-Rex head upon Parasaur and Parasaur's head upon Raptor. The Raptor's head was fitted upon the T-Rex. She still didn't feel anything was odd until what? Ankylosaurus saw them oh, no. and went flabbergasted. 
Hey T-Rex, were these kids born to be abnormal? That's a long story, man. Can you help me fix their heads for now? With Ankylosaurus's assistance, the dino's heads were fixed properly. And they began to feel joyful about this. The baby dinos are taking a walk into the dense Jurassic jungle. It is where they belong. But they are near the prohibited area of the jungle. But the little ones are always so curious. How about let's sneak in carefully and see what's going on? Nothing worse might happen, guys. All the dinos were agreeing except the parasaur. What do you mean by nothing worse may happen? It's literally a prohibited place. Oh, grow up, man. You need to be brave. All the dinos proceeded, but Parasaur was reluctant. They slowly sneaked in only to see automobiles all over. The dinosaur truck won their attention. They casually went near to see it and accidentally the stand fell. The truck activated and ate Ankylosaurus. Both the dinos began running away. Parasaur saw from afar and got alert. Oh no! The truck soon ate the Triceratops and then the Parasaur. Parasaur was quite away and he's doing a good job running from it. The truck isn't even sparing the stones or rocks. But it surely can't swallow wood. I stopped them from entering that restricted area. But they didn't listen. Now a weird truck ate them. Now it's coming to eat me. <laughs> Now it will be a one-on-one -on -one between T-Rex and the truck. <coughs> the little dinos were successfully out. Petition to consider T-Rex as the superhero of Jurassic World.
Welcome to the Jurassic World of Dinosaurs. The two gentlemen are here for the dinosaur safari adventure. Parasaur and Ankylosaurus will guide them in the vast jungle amongst all the dents and volcanoes. They came across the Pteranodon pair. The flying dinos which were entertained by the butterflies. After seeing the pteranodons, the dinos went down the slope, and then passed by the sleepy stegosaurus. And now they had come across cactuses. As they went by there were signs of an enormous dino approaching. <gasps> the dinos and men were stuck seeing oh, no! the dino. <laughs> he let out a big roar and began chasing them. While they were running away in an escape. And the man fled and fell onto the cactus and got his butt hurt. T Rex began laughing at him while he was still stuck by the terror. He was being chased in many turns. And the guy even went up the hill but couldn't get rid of the T-Rex. The man was frightened seeing the aggressive dinosaur since it was a dead end. Oh no! Meanwhile there came Pteranodon for the rescue. What? It immediately caught hold of the man and took him with it while T-Rex roared in annoyance. Finally, the dinosaurs celebrated the man's revival. Baby T-Rex is riding his expensive Jeep somewhere. He stopped at the fruit store. Let's buy fresh fruit for ourselves. I bet mom would love this. It is a really spacious store with good structure and interior. A wide variety of fruits are arranged and presented neatly. There are many racks too. And they even sell fresh juices. Seems like the baby T-Rex comfortably went in for shopping while the parasaur came there and noticed his jeep. Let's see if that fool had locked the jeep. The parasaur successfully robbed the jeep and rode into the forest. There was this black T-Rex hanging around in the forest. The parasaur has accidentally driven upon him as he ended up falling into the pit. What? Knowing what he did, the parasaur ran away in terror. Soon the black T-Rex got out and began lashing upon the little one. Before he could escape the red T-Rex interrupted. and made the black T-Rex run away. What? T-Rex. 
an aggressive dinosaur that has defeated many crocodiles over his lifespan. T-Rex is walking to the lake again. And it is quite predictable that the crocodile might attack again. No creature is able to drink water properly due to crocodile attacks. Crocodile messed with the wrong one again. turned into a cat fight. Both are attacking each other in turns. This started to get silly until finally both were tired and gave up. A bomb of venomous spirit has entered the dense jungle of Jurassic World. T-Rex is walking to the pond to drink some water. He now peacefully walked over to rest under the shade. The venomous spirit slowly slid down the slope and reached for T-Rex. T-Rex is now possessed. The venomous T-Rex then walked into the jungle to find prey. Soon he came across a few dinos hanging out in the forest and decided to gulp them off. He began chasing Parasaur since he was the only one running alone. The venomous T-Rex began searching for him but instead found a baby T-Rex. But as soon as he reached out, Baby T-Rex began playing with his instrument and the sound disturbed the venomous spirit. So this turned out to be his weakness. We need to end the venom. The Dinus were all prepared to attack the venomous T-Rex. They held the rope and as he got closer, he fell off the rope and saw a parasaur. Before he could reach out parasaur, bars fell on all sides and raptor went hitting all the bars while the venomous T-Rex couldn't help. The Dinos helped T-Rex out and kept banging the bars while Spirit was trapped.
soon a grenade was thrown and the bars were closed. The mighty T-Rex is taking a peaceful walk into the jungle. He surprisingly comes across a luxurious swimming pool. Wow! He immediately runs in and sees many dinosaurs chilling in there. The T-Rex gets himself a cute swimming help and gets into the water. The dinosaurs find this funny since an adult dinosaur doesn't know swimming. And he prefers a cute life support. They all continue to laugh at him. Raptor slides from the top and swims against T-Rex making him fall off the life support and fight for life. T-Rex managed to stand on his own legs. While all the dinosaurs were busy making fun of him. I need to teach this brats a life lesson. He firstly wants to discipline the lady Terry Rex. He shows up as a what? shark and swims around her while she runs away in terror, screaming for help. Then it's Ankylosaurus's turn. He removed the trampoline for his next jump. And Ankylosaurus had greeted the ground. He now finally has to discipline the raptor. T-Rex threw a soap next to the pool. The raptor went sliding onto the wall and then sliding back onto the ground. T-Rex began laughing at the spoiled brats while they were unhappy with receiving their own treatment. What? Raptor began chasing the T-Rex to attack while T-Rex was trying to run out of the pool. But just then the Ankylosaurus attacked him. T-Rex somehow manages to escape them and run for his life leaving the brats to hold a grudge upon him that may last a lifetime. The heads of the Ankylosaurus and Stegosaurus are cruelly cut and placed next to the fireplace. There sat the cunning T-Rex who's an absolute psychopath. He got out of his fearsome den to hunt for more heads. A Triceratops is peacefully resting while the T-Rex came stomping towards him. Perhaps his next victim. What? Triceratops ran away as he approached. But there was a Terry Rex who was resting happily. Perhaps an easy victim. T-Rex performed his attack and non-surgically collected his head and went back to his den. So this is the place where he lives. I heard he is very notorious psychopath who is obsessed with the heads of our kind. I will have a quick look and come back. Raptor sneakily went in but how come he did not expect psychopaths to be alert? What? T-Rex caught him and ran after him. Raptor certainly escaped, but by leaving Triceratops as an easy prey. After a terrific escape, he ran into a normal Tyrannosaurus. You won't be laughing this way if you know the reason. 
A cannibal T-Rex is chasing me to cut my head and eat. The T-Rex still continued to mock Raptor, so Raptor took him for the proof. Did you see that? Go in and challenge him if you can. As soon as the Tyrannosaurus got in his bravery took off. Oh no! He straightly got into attacking the cunning T-Rex without any delay and soon Raptor joined him. And then they implanted the heads back into the Dainu bodies. Not all heroes wear capes. They may wear yellow stripes and tend to laugh at psychopaths. T-Rex and Raptor are peacefully resting in their den. Meanwhile there are a few Dainu kids playing next to T-Rex's place. There is an evil-minded black T-Rex walking by the play area. Oh, it's been a long time. I've done a serious kidnapping. The black T-Rex ran to keep an eye on these little dinos and waited for perfect timing to catch them. Unfortunately, the ball went and fell next to black T-Rex. He took the ball and hit it. Triceratops walked into the woods to find where the ball could be. As soon as he came the evil T-Rex closed Triceratops' face so his screams will not be heard. Hey! I really wonder where he must have been! Parasaur feels something is wrong so he walks into the woods to find Triceratops. Black T-Rex is prepared with the bag and as soon as Parasaur came, he trapped him too. Oh, no! Raptor has seen this from afar and quickly ran after the black T-Rex to save his mates. Soon there came a huge pit. The black T-Rex successfully crossed it but the raptor fell into it. Raptor oh, panicked no! for a while and realized there were a pile of woods. He climbed on them and got out of the pit. He quickly ran to the guardian T-Rex. An evil dinosaur came and kidnapped Triceratops what? and Parasaur. Let's not waste much time. Where did they go? Soon Raptor led them to the direction the kidnapper dino took the kids to. Soon there came three ways and the Raptor was confused. Guys, there's a pit. Let's go from here. They soon climbed up a hill and since there's a clear view of the forest, they began looking for the little dinos from there. What? Parasaur finally found them trapped in a cage. Guys, I found them. Look, there. Let's go and rescue them quickly. The evil T-Rex is giving the kids a tough time, but not anymore. The hero T-Rex is here for the rescue. did a tail attack and the evil guy directly went and fell into the cell. The black T-Rex fell into his own pit. Now he's gonna spend the rest of his life in the cell. Here's a mommy Brachiosaurus guarding her little eggs. But there she collapses due to fatigue. A gang of men riding upon Dino has come there. 
Okay guys, check that out. I think we need to steal those eggs. The dino is sleeping anyway. Now only this theft can make us billionaires. Brachiosaurus is clearly awake. While the men came near to steal those eggs, she completely woke up. What? Upon seeing them, she quickly eats them and they run away. But the men are determined to steal those eggs. I have a plan. Let's tie this rope to the mother. We can effortlessly steal. What do you mean? Let's just show the mother. That is more effortless. The four men had contrasting ways to steal the eggs. Both the men decided to shoot the mother. The pain woke Brachiosaurus up. While she was fighting the pain, the other two men tied rope to Brachio's legs. Come on, let's quickly steal before any other dino pops up. Right what? before the men could leave, a giant T-Rex appeared roaring aggressively. The men shot upon him, but he's bulletproof. Fearing nothing could happen, the men decided to escape with eggs. <laughs> T-Rex tricked the men by snatching the eggs, while they still thought they were carrying the eggs. men tried running away, but the T-Rex unveiled its furious roar. T-Rex casually stamped them into the ground and went to return the eggs to Brachiosaurus. Baby Brachiosauruses have entered the world. Know the mother's joy knew no bounces. A very dense jungle with rare creatures. Triceratops began chasing the forest lizard. As soon as he thought he might escape, T-Rex oh showed no! up. Both the dinos attacked and killed the lizard. The little T-Rex and Triceratops were taking a walk and came across another forest lizard. They began chasing him while he ran for his life. Soon the forest oh no! lizard came across another two dinos who attacked him without any delay. Ah! Raptor and Parasaur soon began chasing T-Rex and Triceratops. This is how the food chain works. The predators are always after the weak. Triceratops soon got upon a sleeping giant T-Rex. She gets to his senses and sees the Dinos. She begins chasing him while they run. Meanwhile the small T-Rex ran into giant Triceratops and the chase began. Soon the T 
two mothers meet. What? Seeing the younger versions of each other, the giant Dinus were confused. Oh. T-Rex thought Triceratops sent its kid to avenge him. While Triceratops thought T-Rex sent his kid that a fight broke out. Both are equally attacking each other. What? <laughs> Seeing both the dinos busy in the face off, the raptor and pterosaur attack the little dinos. What? <gasps> oh no! Mommy! Please help! They might kill us! <coughs> Little T-Rex returned to its mom and so did the Triceratops. They embraced their moms for saving their lives that day. Seems like a dinosaur sanctuary and they lived in harmony. The tiny and cute dinos might have a threat. The T-Rex comes across the area and sees innocent dinosaurs. He's got the carnivorous urge to eat the prey. Just then, he spots what? the Ankylosaurus. Baby Ankylo was given no chance to fight back. Poor him. All the dinos were in terror, seeing T-Rex eat Ankylo cruelly. The dinos were still stunned when the mother arrived. She found her child nowhere, what? and her instincts shot up. <gasps> oh no! Where is my child? <laughs> Where is he? He's no more... It was that psychopath, Trex. What? The T-Rex is happily resting in the jungle. Whilst Ankylosaurus finally found the horrendous murderer of her son. It's going to be an intense face-off between a heartbroken mad mother and a Satan. Done and dusted. The evil dinosaur is out of this world. The molten hot lava is fuming from the volcanoes whilst puddles of them are being spit out. The tension is crazy. 
It finally erupted, but what emerged wasn't the lava. It's the lava that's born as Turax. By taking molten hot footsteps, Turax proceeded to the forest. Meanwhile, there are a few Dinus who are having fun. But Triceratops panics seeing the gigantic T-Rex approaching. All the dinosaurs escaped while Triceratops couldn't. He was subjected to his beam and he instantly turned into ashes. He notices the other dinosaurs and decides on chasing them. With great difficulty, they crossed the river without being caught by T-Rex. He saw the water. He feared and ran away. Guys, did you just see what I saw? That bloody dinosaur is afraid of water. What do y'all think? We should be planning to defeat him since we came across his weakness or he might make Earth inhabitable. He was resting at Triceratops' place. Terry went there to trigger him. What? He successfully did and the chase began. jumped into the lake. The T-Rex was still on the verge of falling. Oh, no! So the two dinos helped by giving a push. All his parts are dislocated and Earth is safe. T-Rex is fashionably chilling in the forest as usual. There comes a gift rolling towards him. Seems like the universe is impressed by his non-chaotic attitude. What? T-Rex curiously tries to sense the gifty. It moves and T-Rex panics what? and hides behind. Oh, no! It's time for the reveal. Hello, dinosaur. Thank you for letting me possess you. Hence the pig had casually adopted T-Rex. The universe wanted some chaos and T-Rex is the chosen one. The adventure begins. There were a few dinosaurs chilling by the waterfalls. Lovely meat! Pig-headed T-Rex took a greedy run to gulp Terry Rex off. Meanwhile, the Pteranodon who happens to be alert. What? Quickly saved Terry Rex from being gulped off. This moment, I'm saved from the Piggy Rex due to Pteranodon's greatness. Let's all be alert like him. Just then, he comes across a Triceratops and roars at him, signaling that he will be eaten. Meanwhile, Triceratops is having his laughter moment seeing the hybrid of Piggy and T-Rex. Already annoyed, Piggy had ate him off. The Piggy Head is taking a confident walk after a small victory that's the result of annoyance. Just then Pteranodon flew as a part of the plan, and when Piggy Rex set the chase, Terry slid a log and he fell. 
the Dainus repeatedly attacked and tried fucking the head off. Terry Rex got a weapon for defense. He used a web gun. Using this, I'll pull that Satan's head off. And you will be helping me in offering support. Terry launched his plan successfully. And the little dinos have successfully pulled the pig's head off. T-Rex is back to his senses. He buried the pig's head under a huge rock. The mommy and baby T-Rex are taking it towards the sea. They might be having a philosophical time. Well, no. We are going to hunt sharks. The bay is clearly excited. Mommy T-Rex jumps into the sea for a shark. Meanwhile, baby T-Rex is relaxing amongst the natural aesthetics. He sees a butterfly and runs behind it like any other Disney main character. Which leads them to some sort of trouble. Meanwhile Mommy T-Rex is still struggling to catch the shark. Meanwhile the baby is unbothered and befriends the butterfly. But there are two dinosaurs next to a fireplace to tackle the cold. An evil T-Rex avenges a plan. The Dinus meet an evil T-Rex, and the rest becomes a chase. <coughs> to which Parasaur becomes the prey. Raptor hides behind and sees his beloved friend being eaten by an evil T-Rex. Now, he gets chased. Meanwhile, Mommy T-Rex successfully got the shark and excitedly goes to her son. Meanwhile, the little T-Rex is still unbothered while evil comes his way. Raptor sees little T-Rex and eventually knows he could be the prey. Therefore, he quickly ran away as soon as the T-Rex approached. The evil guy's eyes fell upon little T-Rex. Raptor is watching the show from afar. The baby is in crisis now. What? Mommy T-Rex's mother instincts went a blue. She looks around and doesn't see her baby. She instantly knows something isn't right. Raptor hits a tree upon evil T-Rex to divert him. But the evil guy's hungry for the little one's life itself. Mommy T-Rex is here. She instantly ran to protect her little life. hits the evil skull with the wood. Mommy T-Rex eats the evil guy with a somersault and that's when she knew. It's over for the evil guy. Not all superheroes wear capes. Some feed to yummy sharks. The Super Dinus are having a jam. 
A giant dinosaur comes marching that way. While all the dinos curiously looked, they realized that it's none other than Brachiosaurus. The dinosaurs love him. He is captivated by the radio jams and began vibing to it while all the dinos cheered. Now the trouble comes marching aggressively. A dinosaur totally opposite from the Brachiosaurus with a calm and soft demeanor. He sneaks from the tree and spots the Brachiosaurus. He is definitely oh, yeah. planning to attack. Brachiosaurus quenches its thirst and walks back home. Trek sprinted and attacked Brachiosaurus. Poor Braccio got up and aggression took over him. He is all set to attack T-Rex. But he was yeeted by Braccio as if he was a cricket ball. Therefore, he ran from the T-Rex. At a distance his dinosaur friends are resting after a long party. Braccio comes to them to seek help. Meanwhile T-Rex is overconfident that he can defeat all. Triceratops went on for an attack, but he got kicked away. All the Dinus are determined to help their friends. They collectively went to attack while the T-Rex ran in terror seeing the rage. Oh no! After running a long distance T-Rex began roaring like a mad dinosaur threatening the Dinus to let him oppress them all. But soon Terry Rex sitting like a crown on the Brachiosaurus enters the heat. He jumps onto T-Rex and disrupts the roars by attacking T-Rex's neck. What? Taking advantage of his state all the dinos collectively given their respective doses. The air is filled with aggressiveness and enthusiasm. The dinosaurs are threatening each other. The face-off might begin with Terry Rex hosting. Cheer for the raptor and ankylosaurus. Let round one begin. The tension builds up. An ankylosaurus does a quick yet strong attack onto raptor. One, two, three. He isn't waking up. But this isn't the end. Surprise, said the raptor. He woke up. What? The winner of round one gladiator is Raptor. Now, we got a cheer for Triceratops and Terry Rex. Let's begin round two. Triceratops plans on teasing Terry while Terry feels strong when he's annoyed. Therefore, he attacked Triceratops and he fell. Being a giant dinosaur, he used his power to crush Terry into a copy. He is a mastermind and can easily defeat Triceratops with a mind game. Certain 
extremely successful. <laughs> Therefore, the winner of round two gladiator is Terry Rex. Moving on, cheer for Parasaur and Stegosaurus. Stegosaurus did a tail attack, but the Parasaur mightily got up and decided not to give any chance to the Stegosaurus. <coughs> Meanwhile, there comes the T-Rex. His one roar made the Dinos shut and terrified in fear. ring and attacks the Stegosaurus and eats Parasaur. Stegosaurus gets up. He's got a fierce courage to pull up a fight with the T-Rex. He did another tail attack. And another. And another. Several times. Stegosaurus is certainly the winner and the hero to the Gladiator Tournament. A wild T-Rex is taking a peaceful walk in the jungle. He came across two paths, and he chose one. Little does he know about the gang of scorpions that avenge for blood. They sense the victim's footsteps. He looks like a fool. I think he is perfect. The T-Rex sees the gang and approaches them out of curiosity. A Scorpio has just given him a sting and he began screaming at them. All the scorpions took a jump and landed on him to sting till their content. He fell and the scorpions took over his body and continued attacking. But T-Rex was nonetheless. He successfully yeet had many scorpions and killed many. and took them for a oh, feast. Yeah. <laughs> Meanwhile, he sees a Triceratops resting under shade, making use of his unconsciousness. Oh, yeah. T-Rex decided to prank him, so he threw the scorpions upon him. The scorpions begin stinging Triceratops. He gets rid of them and sees the T-Rex right above. Aggression took upon Triceratops. He eat had few scorpions and began mashing down the remaining. What? He then encounters the giant scorpion. The king of them all. Triceratops bravely went on to attack, but he was defeated. observing Triceratops and went awestruck. Oh no! Triceratops finally spots him and the chase begins. T-Rex ran for life since he didn't want to be dead. Right in the deserted area of Dino Land, 
The bird was singing. It has its reasons. But she has caught the attention of a sad buried dinosaur, who's none other than T Rex. Seems like it has been an eternity, he hasn't eaten anything. After looking around, T Rex spots ants walking to their colonies with hard earned food. He decides on getting them. T Rex cleverly hit himself and closed the way to their colonies. The innocent ants entered his mouth instead. I felt choked for a moment. Oh no! But after vomiting a few leftovers, he's content and takes a joyful walk. Distance afar, he sees exhausted dinosaurs and runs to them. What? Oh yeah! them away from there and runs after them. The Dinus are cleverly running as three by standing upon one another. The Dinus ran to a lake and diverted. But the T-Rex was tricked to fall into water and all the sand in his body came off and he turned into parts. While the Dinus are busy celebrating this, T-Rex resurrected and begins chasing them. They take a different turn while T-Rex takes a different one. That evil guy will not die just because of water. I guess we should be filling him with concrete so he stays stable. And then we break his head. The Dinos did what suited them and now they are free from evil.